actually, that's hat. That's what clock has. Oh yeah. Yeah, clock has oh, that short. So we can... Yeah, clock has this short. Okay. Go tell mom a happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. So happy Mother's Day to oh kids here Amber. Uh, she is a wonderful mother and does a lot for our kids. I also want to uh, take this time real quick also to uh, say Happy Mother's Day to my mom, Judy. Hi, Mom. I'm sure you were watching this. I love you, and thank you for everything you have done for me in all my years of my life. Um, and uh, also, Happy Mother's Day to my mother-in-law. Uh, I uh, hope that uh, it is filled with joy and fun like I know it will likely be, and uh so, uh, and then also happy Mother's Day to all those other mothers out there um, in the world. So, happy Mother's Day, and um, know that you mean a lot to people. I'm making breakfast while I'm talking. Well, it is uh, Monday, and uh, I am um, got some motivation from a friend to actually write a book. So, I'm actually going to um, kind of piece together a book about the... All the different critter activities and games that I use with my students. Some that are posted on YouTube and some that I ha do not have posted. And some that I will make up to put in the book. So, very excited for this uh, this new trip and, and experience. And, uh, Kevin Tiller is the guy who's kind of motivated me to do this. And I've already shot him out on, the, on my other channel. But... Um, He's being awesome and kind enough to let me use his little people yeah, characters that he created and everything. So, of course, I'm giving credit for him as an illustrator in the book as well. So, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to kind of working on this little project. We'll probably work through the summer on it, and it'll be done. I, I'm hoping it'll go pretty quick, but we'll see. Hello, it is Tuesday, and I am taking the twins down to gymnastics now. Uh, well, a couple weeks ago, the... Uh, started having the same time it used to be viola first and then the next hour was roman so now we got them going on at the same uh same time so we're not down there two hours only one so they're back there mowing down on some food before we go there uh yep there's roman he double fisted he, he said what i'm hungry he grabbed two uh power bar type things so um i'm making a lot of hit we what A fiber bar and a Z bar. Yo. Yep. And what? Huh? And we're gonna stop for a drink. Yes, yes, as, as long as we have time. Yes, at that at that store. Um and so anyway, I have been making a lot of headway on the book. Uh, I've got two more uh activities to actually write up, like uh the directions and how to set it up. And then I have, better not go, I have um, diagrams to make for the activities. So, once I'm done with the lessons, then I'll go back and uh, make those diagrams. So I'm getting excited, getting closer and closer, and it's only been a few days. It's amazing how much quick work goes when you have time to do it. Lou, it is uh, Wednesday, and uh, I'm taking Viola. Viola is soon going to be taking over for me if she can remember her days of the week. Taking her down to uh, the nurses, and then um, Amory's going to go and get a massage, and I'm going to hopefully be able to go work on that book a little bit more. I really haven't uh, worked on it a whole lot today. A um, little bit during lunch, and um, yeah, that's it. I had to I had to take some pictures of the um, today. I had to take some pictures of the equipment for the description to put those in there, and then for the graphics. And uh, yeah, that kind of took up my time doing some of those. And now I'm ready to go start to piece together the actual um, diagrams. So all the units, all. The, Lessons are written. Just got to now make the diagrams and send it off to the editor, the wonderful, great Kevin Tiller. Well, uh, before I left, I forgot about this. Before I left to drop Viola off, 
uh, and uh, uploaded a, another video to my uh, Teachers Inspiring Teachers channel. Um, and when I set that channel up, I remember wanting to change the uh, the ending after YouTube.com. I wanted Teachers Inspiring Teachers. Well, the, the problem is I, I can't do that. I can't make a custom uh, URL without um, having... Um, a hundred subscribers and then at that point I can do a custom URL uh, so I'm asking a favor for all you out there if you could go over there and just at least subscribe to it you don't even need to watch the videos if you don't want to but if you could subscribe to it and help us get to a hundred so I can maybe change the uh, um, change the URL that would be that would be fantastic because I can't remember the numbers and digits and all that kind of stuff um, I don't even know what the actual uh, web address is. If you, if you're gonna do it, and uh, you can always go on my Twitter and, and find the recent tweet. I usually tweet it out on Wednesdays in the afternoons, um, or you can go through my channels I subscribe to, and it should be on that as well. Um, that, that would be awesome if you can help. I am starting to understand why my parents used to get onto us about. Um, having too many lights on in the house. I think every light has been turned on in this house all at one time at some point. If I haven't gone through and turned them all off by now. So, it is uh, Thursday. Almost Friday. Still working on the book. Making some headway. And now I'm looking at it. It is stuck in the uh, safe mode. I, I hope... <laughs> I hope it didn't freeze on me. I just uh, entered a, yeah, it wouldn't be too bad. It was like maybe only one graph that uh, maybe got uh, messed up. I am having some problems with the program after I bring an image in front of another image. If I go back and copy that page, it like changes everything. So I think once I have all my diagrams uh, configured or whatnot, uh, I will go back and just double check to make sure it, the characters are lined up correctly with the basically I have a person and then I have them holding like a, an animal critter thingy and sometimes it gets pushed behind a person when it should be in front of them showing like they're holding on to it if that makes sense um, it will if you buy the book uh, so I'll just have to go back through and that will be part of my uh, proofreading that I'll have to do well I was too slow on the camera I had two bunnies in the backyard hopping around Tried to film him, but I was just, oh, he did close it. Yeah, I gotta get in my car and he closed it. Have I mentioned I only have five diagrams left? Five! And done. Get over to my friend and then proofread. Maybe Amber will too. I'm horrible at spelling. Horrible. Well, it is Friday. So Xander and I are heading home on this fantastic Friday. Uh, I have one diagram left in the book, and I will be done. Well, ish. Done-ish. Um, that part's done, so uh, I'll just need to go back through and, uh, uh, not critique it. Edit, edit, edit it. So, I gotta do that. It's done, it's done, it's done, it's done, it's done. The book is done, it's done. Well, kind of. The editing phase is still taking place. And I do have to add, uh, at the very end, uh, I was talking to Kevin, and he was saying, I, I just didn't know how to finish it. And he had a good idea, you know, put my about me, about the author section at the end, which should be easy peasy, no problem. I can do that. It's not like it's tedious work. I could probably actually just copy and paste what I have on my uh, Facebook page. And he, was, he had a cool idea too. I, and I do have my website on there, not Facebook, website page. Um, he did have a cool idea about putting uh, QR codes or links to my different, like my YouTube channel, my Teacher by Teacher store. Well, oh God, they should know that if they're buying the book. But at least have those links on there as well. So great suggestions, great ideas. And um, I'm very excited that it's done-ish. I mean, all the hard stuff's done, all the major stuff done. Now it's just the minor tweaks. Yes. Morning. It is uh, Saturday. Actually, it's almost uh, it's almost 11, I think. 
Um, I'm gonna go outside and mow. It's kind of chilly out. Might have to put a long sleeve shirt on, pants or something. <laughs> it's nice. I like it. Windows are open in the house. Uh, I I finalized uh, most of the stuff for my game, except for the going through. Uh, wait for uh, Kevin to get back to me on that when he gets a chance, and then I'll probably go through it as well myself and and read through it and fix any errors I see. But um, yeah, uh, I put my about me section all in there and everything. So yeah, time to go mow. Mm, I thought you were getting your socks. Not smelling woofy. Let's go. So Viola and I are off to the store to get uh, mom some thread. And uh, Viola wants some Transformer pajamas. Yeah, what? Like what? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Some GI Joes. Yeah. Oh. Like what? What kind of pajamas are we gonna look for? Fruits. Okay, we'll see if we can find some fruits pajamas. Yes. <laughs> okay, we'll look for those. Yeah, you get to go to that piece of candy. Where's it at? Hmm? Oh, I see it. It's Let's over go. there by your elbow. Okay. Yeah, right there. Okay. Yep. You gotta move your character back. Back, back, right there. Huh? Oh, good old standby. Pigs in the blanket for dinner. Uh -uh. My dog, corn uh -uh. dog, whatever you want to call it inside the Christmas roll. Oh, Dolly dropped all of her food! All right, we're going to end the vlog. See y'all next week.